Hello, I'm Sifu Joseph Simonet, founder of Key Fighting Concepts. This video is being shot on location at the Wind and Rock Training Facility in Chelan, Washington, United States of America. Welcome to the video, You're Already Dead. Actually, a subplot to You're Already Dead is you're already dead and you don't even know it. It was a very interesting experience I had a few years ago I'd like to share with you and how we came up with the title for this video series. I was working with a group called Stone Temple Pilots. They were big in the 1990s, early 2000s, and I worked personally, my wife Addie and I, with Scott Weiland, the lead singer. We got him off of heroin through training and visualization and good diet and so on. But the point of the story is, we were in Lake Michigan, outside of Chicago, salmon fishing. It was Scott Weiland, myself, a person I'm going to refer to as Johnny Law. Johnny Law was an older gentleman, very gruff, knew everything in the world, very smart, very powerful. He thought he was James Bond. But really, in my opinion, he was more like Gomer Pyle. And if you don't know who that is, that's fine. It's just kind of a goofball. Anyway... So here we are out on this fishing boat having a couple beers, Scott Weiler and myself, Johnny Law, and the two guys running the boat. And this guy gets in my face. Oh, I've been a U.S. Marshal, and I've been this, and I've been that, and I, I know hand-to-hand -hand combat, and I'm a badass, and on and on and on and on. And he was like really close to my face talking to me. And I'm going, dude, give me a break. Chill. Have a beer. We're salmon fishing. And he had to prove to me how tough he was and how smart and worldly he was. And I thought it was interesting because most people who really are those things don't have a need to prove it. However, so here's this guy in my face. And he's talking, his lips are flapping. And all of a sudden, I couldn't hear him anymore. And all I could do was see his lips moving. And I thought to myself, dude, you're already fucking dead and you don't even know it. And he just kept moving his lips. In fact, what I did then is I said to him, I go, you know what? You're such a dumb shit that what's happened is I just came up with an idea for a Paladin Press title called You're Already Dead. And it's going to talk about you and how idiotic you are. And then I, re I realized all the martial artists and all the reality-based dudes and all the badasses out there really don't have a clue what they're talking about in most cases. Are there exceptions? Of course. And so I really enjoyed the idea that I told him that in three years, this will be on video, and he's going to be the subject matter of this, whole, of this whole video series. So that's how the origin of that started. Now, with Kyle's help, let me show you kind of what happened, just to give you an example literally. So Kyle's, this is Johnny Law. Come on, Jared, come on up. So Johnny Law is talking to me, and he's like being somewhat animated, and he's in my face, and he's this and that. I'm thinking, fuck you, get away from me, and I want some space and some distance. He had no idea he was in my range. The other fun thing is, come up, now he's got a little closer, and I said, boom, I'm going to grab his fucking dick, and I'm going to rip it off. How do you like me now, dumb shit? And he's still flapping his lips. So he didn't know I was doing this in my mind. And I'm choreographing this whole thing. Then he got closer. I love this one. But you know what? Boom! <laughs> you know, you're dead. You're already fucking dead. And this is what I just did. From here, actually, we're going to go over this in quite detail, specific detail of how we get into our stance right here. And I'm trying to be the adult. And what I did is I just jammed my fingers into his eyes. I'm uprooting his, his uh, jaw, jamming right into him. And the fucker's already dead. He doesn't even know it. Now, let me give you an example. Take the helmet off, please, Kyle. This is exactly what I'm doing. It's, it's, this man's talking, talking, talking in my face. First of all, if you want to fight somebody or you're, you're going to be in a confrontation, I would leave. <laughs> I would get out of there, okay? Leave the area, put the beer down, and go, all right? But certainly, you're not going to be, hey, yeah, you know what, bitch? These people that come up and do this kind of <laughs> they're already dead and they don't even know it. They're in your kill range. You know, we've, we've talked ad nauseum about kill range in the key fighting concepts paladin dvd series that we've done over the years okay but kill range is essentially kyle's longest weapon 
plus a couple inches. So if he was talking to me and he took a step, I'm going to try to maintain that range. But we've been over that, like I say, ad nauseum in, in great detail. Check out other projects that we've done with Paladin. However, if they're in your face here, you can always just grab their dick and rip it off, okay, if, if, you, if you'd like. I'm bringing my hands in closer, boom, and I'm popping them back so now I can make, give myself some distance and then I can deal with them effectively, all right? The other thing is here, uh, that's turned a little bit for the camera. When I'm here talking, I'm the adult in the room, and when he's already this close, my hands are here. I'm popping his jaw. So they're talking, they're flapping their lips. They're going to shatter their teeth, maybe bite off some tongue if you're lucky, all right? And then that kind of hurts, and it tends to shut them up. What do you think? So from here, when I'm doing this, I'm also jamming my, feet, my thumbs right in their eye. Not a lot of people deal well with that, okay? And, that, and that's been proven over and over and over throughout the ages. So when I'm here and he's talking blah, 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 and I see that this has escalated beyond just pushing them away and leaving the area or getting some distance, and it's actually escalating where he's like pressing me, and this is a problem now. I'm, I'm just going to I'm gonna jam and headbutt him and fuck him up, and I don't really care what I do from there because the dumb shit's already dead and doesn't even know it. Well, Johnny Law, wherever you are in the world, thanks for the introduction. <laughs>